Hi, I'm Dan O'Malley from Cisco, and I'm with Monique Lampson. Today we're going to demonstrate some endpoint connectivity on the Cisco IPIC system as well as the IP command. So this is a two-way radio which integrates to a nice Cisco router. So Thank you. Monique, can you push our button there? Sure. Hello, testing Dan. <laughs> You can tell that all these <laughs> devices are online and we get a little bit of feedback. This is a Cisco wireless phone with a nice push to talk button on the side using the Wi-Fi network. Testing, one, two. And you can see that push to talk audio from my wired Cisco, or wireless Cisco phone as well as our wired Cisco phone all talking on the ch same channel. We have some smart devices here, a couple of Android. Uh, using the Cisco Instant Connect mobile client, and we also have it available on Apple. So all these devices talking to one another. So Monique, tell us about the IP command touchscreen. Okay, well, what's really nice about the IP command touchscreen is it can be in a number of different environments. So if you were in the command and control center and the dispatch center itself, you would use this um, this stable screen over here and then if you are out in the field you can then use the T3 flex on the laptop. What's really nice about both of these is that as you do communications through the radio you can see where the screen would be able to pick up those uh, radio signals and then the dispatch user can manage all of those calls on one side. What's really um, interesting is that you can you see that there's a number of different um, applets that are on this particular screen and that allows the end user to be able to customize whatever environment that they're going to need whether it be managing the radio on one side they've got their workspace in the middle and over on the other side they can also uh, manage all of the uh, call management that goes through so phone calls to towards the right the middle of the screen you can set up as a, a workspace if you want to have pre program dial out numbers in the middle and then all the, you can set up the radio channels on the left. So when, right. I, when I push my button, you should see a red indication on the VHF radio channel. Testing. <laughs> and you can see that a audio is coming into the... Did you uh, pick that up? You want me to push the button again? I can do that. Sure. Go ahead. Testing. One, two, three. Oh, that sounds nice. Well, there are certainly a lot of user interfaces for not just two-way radio, but telephone... Uh, uh, incoming calls as well and outgoing calls so well thank you Monique and thank you for watching thanks Dan